day 1153 um it is i think like 4 30 or 5 just going for a walk just in it in it <coughs> still sick which everything is worse when you're sick um and i'm just i was watching this video by uh this guy who like teaches business and uses the bible and he was talking about in everything you do, you have to give 100%. <clears throat> and he's talking about giving your best. And I'm just sitting there and I'm like, Lord, what is, what is holding me back? You've given me like everything. Like an amazing framework, an amazing brand, amazing skills and abilities to design and to lead and inspire and speak and encourage people and to create products and services and teachings and tools like <coughs> you've literally given me everything I could ever need and I feel like I'm just wasting it all like it's no accident that the problem that I'm born to fight and defeat in this world is wasted potential because that's the story of my life and it's just like, for me, the most frustrating thing in the world to see that I have it all in front of me and I don't know what I don't know. I don't know what's holding me back. I can't see it. And I'm just like, Lord, just reveal to me what, what is stopping me from just stepping forward. And I don't even know what that step looks like, but <coughs> like, man, it's just so frustrating. It's so frustrating to see your greatness right in front of you, but not reach out and grab it like I don't even it's just like torture it's like mental and spiritual and emotional torture it's like you're being held underwater and your mouth is like this close from the surface and all you gotta do is just go an inch to get a gulp of air but you just can't it's like right in front of you and you just can't oh there's a big possum right there on the sidewalk they're such weird looking creatures oh don't cross the street there's a car coming and um yeah it's just <clears throat> super frustrating and uh yeah and i'm just tired and exhausted and i'm sick of coughing and blowing my nose and being exhausted and i'm just thinking like god what am i doing wrong like it's just like, God, do you just have me where you want me? <clears throat> and I just got to surrender to that? Or am I missing something? Am I doing something wrong? Am I not doing it? And I just feel like there's something I'm not doing. There's something I'm missing. And I don't know what it is. But it just feels like it's my fault. Like, like it's my responsibility that things are the way they are. And I'm sure that's probably the case. Of course they are. <clears throat> and there he is. And so, yeah, it's just unbelievably frustrating, though, to, to see it all. And, you know, he's talking about just doing your best and giving 100% and doing that. You know, that's really powerful. And so, um, and I've been working on, since I've been bedridden, <coughs> I've been putting together the workbook. Wow. Look at all those birds. Dang. Um, but since I've been in bed, I've just been working on the workbook because I'm supposed to go meet with this pastor who's also an influencer. He has 1.3 million subscribers on YouTube and he's like a well-known pastor online and he wants to talk about me bringing <coughs> my coaching to everyone in his church, which is amazing. Um, and I just, so I'm putting together the workbook so I haven't printed out so I can sit down and show them because I know that that workbook is like powerful and when people can see it and touch it and hold it. <coughs> oh, God bless me. Please God bless me. <laughs> um, <coughs> now when they can see that workbook, it just is... so over it so over it <clears throat> when they can see the workbook 
they can pick it up and they can hold it and it's like there's so many things i'm doing like adding qr codes to every page so uh when they're done with the the group call all they have to do is take a picture of the qr code and takes into a video that explains their homework for the next week so it's all automated and just like the design is amazing i spent hours like cropping out these pictures from uh, these like biblical pictures and all the stories match up to the <clears throat> to the thing i'll do a video on it later but it's really really good i've never seen a better workbook like it's amazing and so i look at that and as exciting as it is it's also frustrating because i'm like how have i not gotten this out there well i don't have that to get out there yet but it's just like man chris god is just giving you gold like he's giving you so much <clears throat> And, uh, yeah, so I'm just, <coughs> just like, yeah. And I felt something in my spirit just said, go, go take a walk. So I'm going for a walk and I'm going to get back in and just try to have another conversation with God and just, man, God, what is it? And maybe... Maybe it's just I'm trying to figure it all out and maybe I just need to let go and surrender to the timing he has and the things he's lined up. Like when I go meet with this pastor this week, like he could be, say something like bring, we're going to do this for everyone. I want you to come speak on stage in two weeks and we'll get the workbooks printed for everyone. And then it's like once that falls in place, I know what things to build. I know what things to create. I feel like there's so many things for me to build and create. And I don't know which is the thing <coughs> that I need to build right now. And yeah, it's just, and it doesn't help because I'm sick. My mind is blurry and foggy. And so I'm not thinking as sharply as I normally do. So yeah, but I'm just trying to understand this relationship with God of how much do we just surrender to where we're at versus how much do we just take control and go for it and and like how much do we you know visualize what we're going after how clear of goals do we set like those are all things that I'm trying to learn and understand coming from the personal development world <coughs> I don't want to fall into any traps of the world but I also know those things work so yeah so I'm just uh, figuring things out <coughs> uh, yeah I'm in it I'm in it but it's okay because I know it's only temporary and yeah I'll get out of it God will bring me out of it I'll fight to get out of it. <coughs> That's a good thing is I know that I'll never stop fighting. So it's just not in me to, to quit like that. So I'm just going to keep fighting, going to keep pushing, going to keep going for it. So yeah, because I got everything it takes and now I got God. So how could I fail? How could I fail? I think it's pretty easy, actually. Don't take action. I think that uh, sums it up right there.